All right, serious question. Have you thrown down, worked it, or gotten your groove on lately? I think you better. Move, damn you! Hey everybody, took a couple weeks off because I was doing a dance show over at Pierce College. It was pretty great. We sold out all three nights. Uh, it was about two months of rehearsal working up to this thing. Uh, but here's what I want to talk about regarding that. Um, a lot of times we'll have guest choreographers of all different styles come in and teach. And oftentimes the, the guest choreographers, they won't really invest too much of themselves into these shows because it's really not a long time to work up to the show. It's just a college show. People think, oh, it's just friends and families who really cares. So they'll just come in, drop some choreography and leave and not really get all that into it. But there was one guy in this concert, and we very rarely get in, get a teacher, just a real gem of a person, who just came in and just really affected everybody. And his name is Mr. Lanes. And I had not gotten to see his dance until we had gotten to show week and staging rehearsal. But when I finally did see it, what I witnessed was uh, pretty profound. Mr. Lane staged his piece, and although it had some rough edges, he was working with about a dozen people, every person danced with a clear intent. Lane's made a tremendous effort to instill a strong confidence in everyone, and he always reassured the group that any mistakes they made were ultimately inconsequential as long as they danced with their hearts, and that he was proud of their hard work no matter what. And that heart, that pride that he just kept infusing in everybody, it just, it just, it radiated out and it made any errors that anybody made just completely irrelevant. It wasn't just movement and it wasn't just choreography. He worked his dancers very hard, but took every opportunity to lift the group up and make them into something greater. Their different skill levels being of no consequence. So college show or not, it was still an irreplaceable time in their lives, and it was something deserving to be proud of in the end. He wanted the absolute best in what little time he was provided and was truly invested in everyone's evolution. Like, I found that myself turning over my own possibilities and my own mindset towards dance just by listening to him thank his dancers for being in his piece. And this is something we should all exercise in life, just a fundamental appreciation of what we can achieve together. Teaching is not always the same thing as improving somebody. If you have the opportunity to teach open minds as well as make them believe that they can surpass what they are, then nothing is squandered. You flood a group with positivity and it will spread.